Hello and welcome to the first episode from The Interceptor. Today we will discuss the actual philosophy behind the design, fabrication, testing and launch of our rockets. This philosophy is built on two main pillars, cost effectiveness and sustainability. As ARCA's main focus is related to the civilian orbital rockets, you may ask yourself what's the connection between the orbital rockets and the A1 anti-ballistic strategic interceptor, the A1 derived directly from the ECHO rocket's first stage, which has at its core the two pillars of cost effectiveness and sustainability. So, in order to understand the A1 product, we need to understand our approach on how we design, build and launch rockets. We will go back in time, almost three decades ago, at the end of the 90s. The difficult environment in which ARCA was born and operated after the fall of the communism in Romania in the 90s in a country struck by economic crisis. How unfortunate I was to cross my path with an influential person from the aerospace domain at the beginning of 2000s and how this affected ARCA during the next two decades and what course corrections I was forced to take to mitigate the effects of these bad actors' actions. How the difficult environment forced me to put cost effectiveness above performance when I design rockets and this ultimately led to the creation of a unique product. When I first had the idea of an ecological rocket. How every aerospace company in the world tried and failed to create a truly cost-effective rocket and why I consider that a cost reduction of spaceflight even with an order of magnitude isn't sufficient. How the ecological steam propulsion launch assist system booster led to the creation of the Eco Rocket, and how the Eco Rocket concept, in its turn, created a whole family of ecological, extremely cost effective rockets ranging from orbital to military applications.